Singles. Everybody, let's really be honest, everybody got a list, right? Everybody has something that they desire in a person. But what I find very interesting is so many people have this agglomerate list, but you don't fit no criteria on your own list. So what I want to share with you in this episode is become the list that you desire. Because you expect so much from somebody else. Guess what? They're going to expect something from you, too. Man, you are really encouraging me, motivating me, inspiring me. But God is really using you to help me out. Family, you guys are so amazing. It's your boy, Mr. AOS Inspires and AOS the Podcast. I had to pause real fast to let you know that this episode is sponsored by Urban Pulse Podcast. They post everything black. I mean, everything, everything black, right? They post the drama. They post inspiration. They post motivation. Everything black that you can get your talk about, talk on, if you will, Urban Pulse Podcast, they post about it. We're sponsored by Urban Pulse Podcast, the true essence of everything black. I love them guys to like. Family, you guys are so amazing. It's your boy, Mr. AOS Inspires. This is AOS the podcast. I'm crazy excited. This is five minutes of motivation. I'm dropping this in your lap real fast. Pay attention. Buckle your seatbelts. Let's go. So, I had a conversation with somebody, and it's crazy. This is how this episode stemmed. They were like, hey, I got a list of what I desire from man. And I'm like, cool. You know what I'm saying? You got a cool list. I said, what is it? They begin to list everything, financials, health in order, you know, uh, future established, stability. Like, they begin to list some good stuff, right? So then I looked at them, and I'm like, hold on. Let me ask you this one question. Out of everything that you checked that is unisex on your list, how many of those boxes do you check off personally? And she was like, mm, maybe one or two. So I said, there's a problem. How can you expect something from him, but you don't expect it from yourself as well? It bothers me because too many men, too many women are looking for free rides. You're looking for a free ride. You're looking to say, listen, I don't want to put no sweat equity in the game. I want you to do all the work. Matter of fact, I want you to come to the table fully prepared to handle this load that I'm about to drop on you. And it's not sexually. It's like, yo, I need you to take care of me. I have an issue with those type of people. And the reason many of your relationships don't work that long, because you have high expectations from them and low expectations for yourself until you be listen, think about this, fellas and ladies, if you have an expectation, do you not think that they, they won't have an expectation of you? Like there's going to be, think about it. You're not the only one with lists. And I think that that's where a lot of women get it mixed up and twisted up. I ain't got to do nothing but a little cute coming to the table. No, 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 baby. You got to bring more to the table than just looks and sex. Because I don't want to have, I don't want to look at somebody pretty, pretty all day. I don't want to have sex for the rest of my life. But I do want to build some companies. I do want to build a future. I do want to take vacation. Are you cool? Is your per I'm going to tell you this. This is real talk, right? I've seen situations where a man that was a great bachelor financially stable i mean a lot of things right i saw a man that had it all together right per se and he chose a woman that didn't look as good as most women will look or you know that you consider she bad she cute right he chose a woman that was okay but her personality was so dope. She was a go-getter. Her personality was great. She was fun to be around. Vacations was a blast. I mean, you know, it's, it's, it's like that, right? Because you have to bring something to the table that's worth my wow. And that's what I want to tell every single person that's going to watch this video. When you have a list, make sure that you become that list plus more. Because when you don't become that list plus more, what will happen is it'll be a lopsided fight. It'll be a lopsided game. It'll be a lopsided situation. And that's piss poor. Listen, suppose you brought to the table, right? Ladies and men, you brought to the table everything that your list had. But they don't bring to the table half of what your list have, or you don't bring to the they don't bring to the table what they list is involved of. How would you feel about that if the shoes were reversed, if the roles were reversed? I think this. I think a lot of people don't look at it from another person's perspective. They only look at it from their perspective. 
And until you begin to look at it from somebody else's perspective, what will happen is you will always find yourself. I'm out of time. You will always find yourself behind the eight ball because you don't become your list. I love you guys life. I see you next week. Let's go What's going on family. I want to say thank you for rocking with us during this episode. We have been so excited to drop this episode. I'm glad that you made it to the end. This is what I want you to do. If you have any takeaways from this episode, leave it in the comments. We want to hear your thoughts. We want to hear how you feel. I want to bring content to you that's relevant to you that will help you change your life because you already know our mission here at AOS Inspires. AOS the podcast is to empower the world to never give up one conversation at a time one interview at a time, one video at a time to help you live life at the next level. This is what I need you to do. I need you to like, subscribe, share, share this episode. If it spoke to your life, share this episode with somebody. Why? Because you are connected to some people that we're not connected with. And with that connection together, we can empower the world to never give up. I'm Mr. AOS Inspires. This is AOS The Podcast. I can't wait to see you next week. Just in case you didn't know, we drop every single week, three times a week, Mondays, 8 a.m., Wednesdays, 8 a.m., and Fridays, 8 a.m. You need to catch an episode. Matter of fact, catch all three episodes. It's going to be fire. I promise you it's going to help you doing your everyday life. It's going to help you get to the next level. Let's go.